Hey everybody, we are back. Episode 4 of this War of Sows, actually. Let's leave that pause for just a second here. Uh, Goo TV presents, naturally. Um, we have just completed day 5. Uh, we were raided again. Pavel was wounded. And we'll have to see about making him feel better. Hungry, sad, tired. Hungry and tired. Uh, oh, and Bruno has something else to say. I used to be an optimist. One of those people... Who'd have sworn that war wouldn't come? Wars happen far away in third world countries, or so I thought. Even when I was listening to the news get scarier day by day, I did not believe all that was about to happen. Wonderful. Um, <clears throat> Bruno, you need to make us some food, because that's what you do. Uh, Pavel, hungry and slightly wounded. I don't think the herbal meds help with wounds. Um, not positive. I want to keep that book around, because evidently somebody was reading it. Uh, Pavel, let's have you come over here. Marco, hungry, sad, and tired, who is no longer sick or wounded. That's good. No, nope, Pavel. Everybody's going to congregate in the kitchen while Bruno makes us some food. <clears throat> and I should be able to make one more hot meal with the other stuff that's there. Actually... Pavel, you can make yourself useful. Uh, make one of these so that we can get some more rainwater. How how are we doing on rainwater? Oh, we don't have a lot of it. Um, but that's okay. Not a good day. Marco is not doing real good. Bruno, you can eat. Uh, Pavel, who's hungry, why don't you come over here and deal with the rainwater? Uh, Bruno, you can't walk away yet because you're going to cook uh, yes you should make some clean water um, uh, Marco you can eat and then you can go take a nap Bruno in the meantime maybe you can yeah you might as well make one of these uh, while we're at it Use Tim Burrow to make some fuel Pavel um, uh, boy actually Bruno, while you're at it, make an another one of these uh, because we're going to stoke the fire, uh, which Pavel can do momentarily. Marco, sad and tired. Go take a nap, man. Sleep it off. Oh, somebody's at the door. Oh, I do not have enough water for this. I guess I'm in more dire straits for water than I anticipated. Um... Well, you might as well stoke the fire. Bruno, get up there answer the door. No, actually, you're tired. Why don't you go take a nap? Pavel can do that nonsense. Um, yeah, get up there. We'll do a little bit of bartering and then see if we can make something. Move your butt. <clears throat> He's going to have to sleep tonight, probably. Being hungry and slightly wounded, not great. Look at what I brought. Did you bring food? Oh, bandages, cigarettes, for almost nothing. Um, hmm. So, and some filters. Oh, boy, is there anything that we want here? It would be great to have... Uh, I could use some water, but he doesn't appear to have any. So, I don't really have a lot that I want to give up. Could try... Oh, some herbal meds is good for some canned meals. Wow. How about a bandage? Uh, I can give you some more herbal meds. Oh, that's still generous of me. Okay. Uh, how about we throw in some... Boy, I don't know. Um, I mean, we can always use timber components. Wow, all right. You know what? I'm all right with this deal. Got some bandages. I can take tend to that wound. I can get fed. All of these things just for some herbal meds that uh, I don't have an immediate use for. So uh, way to wheel and deal, Pavel. Let's see. Actually, we can squeak out a few more components there. Yeah, looks good to me. Let's do that. Uh, no, I'm good, buddy. You can You can take off. Take care. No, I'd like to close the door. All right. So, 
you are slightly wounded. Uh, which the bandage might be a little bit much for that. Actually, I don't want you to... Uh, no, no, no. I do, however, want you to eat this canned food. Uh, and then we will... We'll, we'll pray that your slightly slight wound can be recovered from sleep. Um, and in the meantime, we will see if we can upgrade our... Oh, no, not uh, not upgrade. Well, actually, I'm kind of curious. Let's see what it would take to upgrade. Actually, I don't know. Wow, I'm really not that far away. Uh, how about... Uh, no. No, let's keep our eyes on the prize. Let's make this herbal workshop. Um, and then, I don't know, maybe some boards? Can we? Make, uh, will we have enough for that afterwards? I'm not sure. Uh, do I have more space for this down here? The answer is no, so we'll have to go up a floor, I think. Yep. Do that. It's kind of exciting. Come on. Move your move your butt here, Pavel. Alright. Uh, oh, we should definitely collect some rainwater before the day is up. Um, but let's see what this gives us. Uh, and then we'll run down there. We'll also check the radio. Um, it's nice and warm and toasty in here. Maybe make, uh, maybe board up some stuff. I don't know. Uh, let's see what we can make. Bandages. What is that? Pure alcohol. Huh. Components and herbs. I don't know where we would get that, but oh look, we can make a cigarette out of tobacco. That's kind of exciting. What's this? Homegrown tobacco. Roll up cigarettes made from herbs. Reeks of crid, bitter smoke. Oh, that makes four, evidently. Well, hey, what is this? That's oh, just regular tobacco. Herbs. How do we... Uh, so we're going to need a moonshine distillery, but in the meantime, we might as well make some smokes for... Uh, for uh, Marco, he'd probably appreciate that. Maybe improve his mood a little bit. Is it possible for somebody to be happy or just not sad? I don't know. That's a fantastic question. A little sip of my tasty beverage here real quick. Excuse me. All right. Now, um, let's go down here. See if we can... We might have to make a moonshine distillery, too. See what we can do with that. Uh, we can board some stuff up. Boards up holes and windows in the building for more protection against looters. Um... Yeah, might as well, I guess. Um, t it does take a decent amount of timber for that, though. Herbal garden. Grow herbs. What about moonshine? Just need parts. Actually, I phew, we might let the boards go. Nah, we can we can f find some stuff. Actually, uh. Maybe that was in vain, but, uh, move your butt, dude. Uh, I'd like, actually, I think I'm going to cancel that. Let's, uh, we got to make sure we fill the water, uh, or get the water going, and then w I'd like to also listen to the radio. What? I didn't, I didn't make that? I could have swore I did. I definitely need to do that. Uh, yeah, make that. Hurry up, buddy. Can you make it? Oh boy, if we miss out on... Oh, I think I get till 8 a.m. I was going to say, if we miss out on uh, water just because of that, that would be super unfortunate. It looks like it makes four water. Uh, that's better than anticipated. And let's see if we can check out the... Uh, yeah... Check out the radio quick. <clears throat> Upcoming days should be nice and warm. It's a good thing we have that heater. Classical music. Animals disappeared from the streets. Uh, same message as yesterday. Music is playing. All right, back to classical music. All right, and that is gonna end our day. It looks like. Um, 
moving on to the night. It takes about 10 minutes or so to go run through uh, that whole day cycle. Um, I don't know if I want to go back to the shelled school. How about quiet house? Lots of food, meds, and parts. Uh, that seems like it might be good. So let's send out our skilled scavenger. Uh, we're going to definitely have Pavel sleep in bed. We'll have Bruno guard again. And we'll take the shovel. Because, I don't know, might need it. Uh, and we'll definitely leave the knife uh, and see what happens. <coughs> oh. When this is over, I'm going to buy myself a house like this. That would be pretty spectacular. Uh, yeah, some components. Let's grab them. See what's next. Marco's still sad. Nothing but useless trash. Okay, what's next? Canned food and timber. Seems like an interesting thing to put out in your yard, but I will take it. Oh. Got some people in there. Let's open it up, see what happens. What is happening? Who are you? I don't... I'm afraid we can't do anything for you. I don't really want to steal from you. Um... You're not going to follow me around the whole house, are you? Uh, what do we got here? <clears throat> There's a letter from Grandpa Bernard to Alan. We're happy to learn that you've come to li like living with Auntie. The war is not that bad. It's just not fun for children. In fact, they say it will be over soon, so don't worry about us. Grandma's feeling better. She asked me not to tell you, but she's saving some flour to make you those cookies you like. And as for me, well, I promise to repair the swing when you are back. Hmm. There is very little here that I can do without ruining this guy's day. There's nothing... Ah... Do I do I take him on with the shovel? Marco is already a pretty depressed fella. Um, gonna, don't worry about me, buddy. I'm just going to look around some more. See if there's anything outside. Okay. I'd rather you stop following me around, dude. I might have to rob you blind. Oh, I don't like this at all. Um, I'm sorry, dude. I think it might have to be kill or be killed. Oh, I feel pretty rancid about that. Are you gonna... I'm gonna take your stuff now, dude. I'm sorry. You're gonna have to deal with it. Wow, I feel like a horrible person. <laughs> oh, boy. So, veggies, raw food, canned food, herbs... Uh, we'll leave the sugar. I have no use for that yet. Uh, looks like Grandma ran and hid. I am a real dick bag. Um, herbal meds, parts. Uh, I don't have a w place to use coffee or fertilizer yet, so we'll leave that be. Um, check out the second floor. Oh, uh, boy. Yes, I am a complete dick bag. Oops, I didn't. What I didn't mean to take the fertilizer. Let's take the parts, electrical parts. There's a good amount of like random stuff here. I did not. I did not get a ton of components and stuff. But hopefully, uh, yes, we want the parts. Might as well take the electrical parts. We'll take the book too. Um, maybe reading will make us feel like less of complete douche waffles uh, I did get a lot of stuff here I mean it's at the expense of these poor old people but uh, at least uh, I can't get through that let's see if we can uh, go around the other way look lady I already feel bad enough please don't make me do something thank you leave me alone I'm just gonna have at your supplies here Oh, wow, I feel awful. 
Uh, homegrown tobacco quality roll up. Well, let's drop the mediocre roll up for the quality roll up. We'll take some more parts. Oh, I can't take some more parts. What can I drop here? Boy, all of this stuff is good. Uh, we'll leave the herbal meds. Uh, care more about the parts right now. Um, and I guess we'll take the homegrown tobacco. That might allow us to make some cigarettes a little better. I, t I don't really care about the book. This stuff is more valuable. Um, electrical parts, I don't know if I need any of that right now, but I didn't have a ton either, so uh, we'll leave that on. And one timber doesn't do me a ton of good, so we'll take herbal meds instead of that. Yep, I think that's going to about do it. Oh, wait, no. There might be a blah. Nope. Okay. I am really sorry, people. Uh, we are horrible, horrible uh, people, that is for sure. I'm sure Marco is not going to be too cheery after that, but what can you really do, man? I mean, it's kill or be killed, right? Man, I feel really horrible about this. Uh, going into day seven. The things that this war makes me do, man. I got bandages so we can help our people. Nobody, uh, nobody came. However, we got some bio stuff. I know it's wrong, but I had to take what we need. Otherwise, we'd have no chance. Thank you for being pragmatic about that, Marco. Bruno, I don't care where and how Marco got supplies. I'm glad he didn't return empty-handed. Wow, okay. Thank you also for not being, or for being pragmatic. I hope these elderly people have some family to support them. We shouldn't steal from them anymore. Pavel, I, I don't know what to tell you, man. Uh, I had to do what I had to do. Uh, Bruno, so everybody's hungry, Bruno and uh, uh, Pavel. Um, Marco, you can uh, have canned food. Um... We could make that right now, but uh, instead, let's burn a timber. Oh, nope, just one. Actually, I should have just had you make two while you were at it. Uh, canned food there. And then, uh, Bruno, you can obviously cook some food. Um, we'll have you... Oops, that's actually not what I meant to do. Um, well, I can make my moonshine still. I think I'm going to need that for alcohol, so I uh, might as well do that and place it maybe up here. Somewhere. Somewhere. Yeah, make it put it in the kitchen. Makes sense. Um, Bruno, you can eat. And then I'll have you make filter and some fuel so you can get the water and... Actually, um, oh, no. Wow, I'm in desperate need of parts. Um, you actually stop that for a minute. I want you to come down here and eat this hot meal. And then you can uh, finish making this moonshine still. Uh, Bruno, why don't you go ahead and, uh, oh, wow, I do, I desperately need, uh, I don't, I don't have the filter for that. I desperately need uh, some some components and timber. Uh, I'm in mad need of of uh, being able to make some stuff. Improved stove, more efficient, allows us to prove. Yeah, saving fuel, great. What about over there here? What? Ah, uh, this is blarg. I know, I knew what that was. Um. Lots of, we definitely need uh, lots of that sort of stuff. Uh, and we, we'll see what we can do with the moonshine. Um, things get easier when you drink it, or so it seems it's a good trading item. I need sugar and fuel for that. Okay, well, I'll keep that in mind. Uh, someone's at the door. Um, homegrown tobacco components we need. Quality, a roll-up cigarette. Um, might as well make some smokes. And, uh, Marco, I guess you can get the door. Let's 
see what is up with this lady here. What do you need? Hey, what's up? Nice place you got here. I'm looking for some place to lay low for a while. I used to live in a large block of flats till it got shelled. Here's the deal. You let me steal, stay here. I, I help you out. I can move as quiet as a cat. Interesting. Okay, yeah, sure. You can stay with us. It's another mouth to feed, but I'm okay with that. Uh, acquiring a fourth person seems useful. For the time being, Erica, why don't you uh, finish doing that stuff? Pavel, can you come down here and check out... Sad and tired. Why don't you just go sleep, Marco? Uh, I'm going to need to make another bed. Marco, I said go sleep. Uh, I need you to be uh, good for laters. Um, desperately need some other stuff here. Erica sneaks quietly. Hmm. Yep, we just need lots of materials right now. I might need another knife. Oh, need weapon parts and components for that. Lockpick don't have enough for that stuff either. This is slightly unfortunate. Uh, nobody's hungry, right? Slightly wounded. Why are you the one... You need to kick this... You need to kick one of these dudes out of bed. Um, slightly wounded. I don't think I want to waste a bandage on a slight wound. Uh, let's get Bruno out of bed. And then you can come down here. <coughs> and then Bruno... You can go pop a squat. You've worked pretty hard. Boy, looks like I could use some more of pretty much everything. <laughs> uh, we're going to end the day. We definitely need materials. Uh, materials are our biggest uh, drawback right now. Uh, so we'll go ahead and end the day. Oh, boy, lots of places we can go. Um, skilled scavenger, you're going to scavenge. Um, Pavel, you can sleep in bed because you're slightly wounded. Bruno. I'm confused. Oh, weird. That it says one out of two for both of them. Um, Erica, you can guard. Actually, oh, we really want somebody to guard who is not tired. Um, I guess Pavel, who's slightly wounded. That's not great, but, um... What can you do? I'm going to definitely need some lots, huge amount of materials, lots of meds, lots of parts. We may find valuable things there, but it's risky. Um, boy. Huge amounts of food, lots of meds, huge amounts of weapons, huge amounts of parts. Caution advised. Not a huge fan of that. Uh, lots of parts. Military outposts, huge amounts of parts. Uh, possible trade, especially for alcohol or cigarettes. But be careful, you never know what to expect from them at the military outpost. Uh, I do have some smokes that I could trade. Um, what about the hotel? Uh, someone moved in there recently and spread the news that it was willing to barter. Maybe he has something useful to us. Lots of materials, lots of parts, possible trade, huge amounts of food. We'll check out the hotel. Um, yeah, and I guess we'll send some smokes with you. And a shovel. Wait, is this the... Is this the place that wanted? No, it was the military that wanted uh, alcohol or cigarettes. Let's, you know what? Let's give it a shot. See what happens. We're gonna have to get outside of our comfort zone, so we'll bring smokes. Uh, I don't have any alcohol, uh, and we'll bring a shovel just in case, I guess. All right, Marco, do your do the dirty. Oh boy. Uh, excuse me. 
All right, so this seems safe to, to grab. Yep, we'll uh, need components, timber, and parts. Components, timber, and parts are big deficiencies. Uh, more components and timber, so we'll just keep doing that. Hmm. Yep, take all that. Um, oh, this guy wants to trade. What do you have? Wow. Dude's got a gun. That's pretty potent. I don't actually... You, I don't, you don't actually have anything that I particularly care much about. Um, I'm just curious. Nope. Not interested. Okay, let's... Okay, okay, okay. Uh, what, can I talk to this dude? This is freaking me out. Yes, take all that. This might have been in vain. Um... Okay, okay, uh, dude, I'm out of here. I, whoa. This place is big. But they didn't like me walking around. Uh, and I don't want to die. I, t boy. I don't, man. I would really appreciate. Can I give you smokes? Nope. All right. I guess that is going to be it. Maybe this trip to the military outpost was in vain. They didn't want smokes as bad as I thought. So uh, with that, uh, we'll see what happened uh, over the course of the night. That uh, I really wish that we would have had something a little bit better there. But what can you do, right? I just didn't want to get shot. Uh, start day eight. We'll see how the night went, uh, and then we'll probably call it an episode. Oh, boy. That's unfortunate. I don't like coming back so empty-handed. Thankfully, it was calm. Uh, so with that, boy, this will be a, a more difficult day where I don't think we get a lot accomplished. But regardless, I want to thank you for joining us. Hopefully you enjoyed this. If you did, give us a like, subscribe if you want to see more of uh, this War Sows or any of the other series as we run with that. And I want to thank you for joining us, and we will see you next time.